This week from Monday to Wednesday, Commissioner Pibags heads to Indonesia for the AZEM Development Conference. He presents the Commission's Asia Agenda and launches an education program with the Indonesian government. On Tuesday and Wednesday, the Competitiveness Council meets in Brussels to discuss the Europe 2020 strategy. Ministers debate consumer rights, the services directive and a relaunch of the internal market. Also Tuesday and Wednesday, the European Parliament in Brussels hosts the Global Jean Monnet Conference, focusing on the impact of the Lisbon Treaty. President Barroso launches the event and Commissioner Vasileo presents the Jean Monnet Prize for European Integration Studies. Also Tuesday and Wednesday, Commissioner Rehn hosts the Economic Forum 2010 in Brussels. Can we defuse the public debt time bomb? Can a low-carbon economy drive sustainable growth? These are two of the questions for speakers including Commissioner Hedegaard and Spanish Finance Minister Salgado. From Tuesday to Sunday, SME Week gathers business representatives in 37 countries to share their experiences on entrepreneurship. At the opening event in Brussels, Commissioner Tajani presents the Entrepreneurship Video Awards. On Wednesday in Brussels, Commissioner Vasiliou presents reforms to vocational education and training in Europe, seeking to improve the allure and quality of lifelong learning. Also Wednesday, Commissioner Hedegaard floats a plan to reduce greenhouse emissions by 30% by 2020. The communication sets out the pros and cons as part of the global shift to a low-carbon economy. Also Wednesday, Commissioner Al Munir presents new competition rules for vehicle manufacturers and dealers, with a view to boosting competition in after-sales and servicing.